Hello. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing part two, why you are not black. And um, before I do anything else, I must give praises to the higher beings above. And the time now is 5.49 p.m. Thursday afternoon. And, and anything else, before I do anything else, Manny Machone, my brothers in South Dakota, I mean water is life. And my other brothers that are live in New Mexico and Pueblo Village, um, I told you they need help too. I got a GoFundMe page for them. But I know it takes time. I've been at this a year and I'm not giving up on them because when I do get money, I'm going there in person, uh, me and my uh, fiance, to help them with the stove. They need wood burning stove. And me, I know I, you post an ask a creative for things, but nobody won't help us, you know. Uh, and me and my wife are indigenous people to this land and stuff like that. We're trying to get a house of so if people can help us. We surely appreciate it. You know, I start a GoFundMe page for our Red Hawk. Wilson and Janice Collins and my son and my daughter that lives in the Midwest. Now, getting back to what I'm saying, you are not black and stuff like that. Um, I don't know why black people do that. They not the only one. Everybody, they label everybody during the 60s. Even Muslims was calling themselves black. And um, we never said that. We always said, uh, colored and stuff like that but they try to make it feel like you are nothing and um there's a lot of meanings behind this word i'm gonna read a little bit of it um black mean colorist board of color also mean pale if anybody checks out the word black in Greek and other European cultures, it comes from the Indo-European culture. Black means pale. So, and it also means, too, if you look up in the dictionary, it also means bad evil, deception. It, it means a lot of things that they put in there, you know, to make you look like you're evil, but you're not. The people that wrote this stuff, they don't want this evil. And um, that's what I wanted to give y'all a little taste of what I just read, but my mother already had told me this when I was seven years old. See, they don't teach none of this stuff in school. And if you don't believe me, look up the word white and see what it, what it means. It means is drip here is a driven snow, you know, and all that stuff like that. So that's what I'm saying. And they try to tell you, you know, the word black don't mean what it means. It means pale. That means they try to say you without a culture and um, and then, then you stupid. And I don't know why um, African American, they not even African American. I don't know why. Y'all accept what people tell y'all. Y'all, you don't let people dictate what you are, what your culture is about. Like I told a girl, when you get a bachelor's degree, they only say you got a degree in in European knowledge, because that's his his knowledge that he giving you. It's good to know his, but you got to know yours too. And I'm sorry to say that a lot of y'all don't know y'all are on history. They do everybody like that. They always betray Italians as gangsters and mafia. Most Italians don't even know what that is. But most Italians are foreigners. I mean, most Italians are farmers, not foreigners. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? So do your research because uh, a lot of times I don't pretend to know anything, but I know enough, you know, where nobody can dictate to me. And like Thanksgiving, all these the holidays, there's seven of them, I think. All of them represent um, Satan, sins, when you celebrate that stuff um, and stuff like that. So I told a girl, it's like uh, Easter come from Koi, uh, 
Kart, I say, it's a German word. And they used to paint, well, well, Easter ain't got nothing to do. It means the same thing. Easter comes from Esther. But it's another word to it. I, I'll find out what it is my wife knows, but she's sleeping. So they dictate everything to you, your way of life, your way of talking. And they all trying to label everybody is the same. And that's not true either. So now y'all know what the word black really mean. It don't even mean, it don't have nothing pertaining to you. Like you said, I'm black. Well, you saying that you're a, a colorist. That's what it means. It also means pale. So I don't understand why everybody say that in Hollywood too. They keep calling themselves black. But it don't mean you ignorant. Y'all, some people just don't know and stuff like that. But uh, what I'm saying, you can look it up. The word black got a lot of uh, definition to what it means. And the word white got a definition of what it means, but it all means good with them and stuff like that. So you have to do this stuff yourself. And I don't, I, uh, they don't teach none of this stuff in school about or what the word black means. Some people, because there ain't nobody, no, no matter the darkest person on the planet, he will not be still black. So, that's all I got to say. You, you know, y'all got to do this, like when I was saying with the word color is, uh, what the word black mean, it mean pale. It's not like, you know, that's what it mean. It mean pale and um, other things that it mean. So it don't mean what you think. Y'all think it pertaining to y'all. Just like them you, you, um, um, YouTubers when they said no, no soldiers in my home, that's the Third Amendment. That means, why would you say a, ask a cop do it pertain to him? It don't. That's why a lot of times the cop play dumb like he don't know. And, and y'all always talking about, oh, you don't even know what an amendment means. How are you going to protect me? You know damn well you don't want that cop to protect you. Well, that's it for now. I hope you like what I'm saying. Comment, share. Subscribe and like. If you like it, two thumbs up. If you don't, two thumbs down. I'm not trying to hurt nobody, but I'm just trying to give y'all my truth that y'all been lied to for the last four and some years. So I talk to y'all later. Dana Wado. Take care and have a blessed evening.